Here's my full and completely honest review of For Him by Raw Chemistry Pheromone Cologne. Oh, hi, Mark. Jumping right into it, short review, because I hate wasting people's time. I'm not gonna lie, it did kind of work. Now, before every guy goes out and buys this, there are a lot of asterisks on that, and I don't think that's the full story. So let's get into the long review. First off, I do wanna say, I bought this with my own money. They did not ask me to make this video. And as it sounds, like I mentioned earlier, this is a pheromone cologne. The concept, and I do wanna stress the science, is a bit fuzzy on this. And if anything, very skeptical, I think for lack of a better word. The concept is, not only does it smell good in general, but there's pheromones in it that make you seem way more attractive. This is the box it comes in. Might as well say I do like the box. I guess it's kind of cool. So you take this off. Uh, let's do this. Comes in like that, opens it up. And this is how the bottle looks, just to show you. And I guess the way you do it is you want to have, you want it to be a skin on skin contact. So you don't kind of put it in your hands and do this kind of thing where you rub it. The idea is, like, say you take off your shirt. I guess I know it sounds kind of weird, but you take off your shirt, you spray it, and you kind of walk through the spray. You do that, you know, a few times, and then you're pretty much good to go. Now, I have to be honest, does it work, does it not? I will say, I did notice a benefit by wearing this compared to when I wasn't wearing it. However, I think there's four reasons as to why that was the case. And if I had to be honest, I think it's a combination of reason number three and four. Reason number one, that's a possibility, the pheromones actually worked in this. I have to be blunt, no offense to this company, I don't think that's the case. A lot of science has just kind of shown like, pheromones are kind of skeptical and a lot of the science hasn't really backed up the claims of pheromones. However, again, everyone has their own experience. I will say on this channel, I have reviewed Pure Instinct before, which is another pheromone spray or like a roll-on uh, product, and it was unisex. So it said that it was geared towards guys and girls, which immediately my red flags went up even more so regarding pheromones. However, on that video, I'd like to be very transparent, I noticed zero effect from that, zero effect whatsoever. However, I got a lot of comments from girls being like, Mark, I'm not gonna lie, I actually use this and I noticed insane results. I noticed that guys were way more attracted to me, talking to me more, like very distinctly, I noticed benefits by wearing this. So it could be, maybe there is some, you know, benefits to wearing pheromones and everything. I do believe in looking at both sides, but I have to be honest, I still feel very skeptical when it comes to pheromones. That's point number one. Point number two, which starts to get more, I think, realistic, is confidence. Not surprising to anybody, if you're more confident and let's say, you know, for lack of a better phrase, the placebo effect is in place, if you wear this, thinking like, oh, I definitely gonna be way more attractive and women are gonna be way more into me and you have that confidence, I can see that in a unique kind of self-fulfilling prophecy way that it's actually gonna help you. I think that there is something to be said about that, that like say if you do go out, you think it's gonna work and everything, and then it ends up working, it's kind of like that famous scene in uh, Space Jam when they have that magic drink to make them better at playing basketball, but it's really just water. Classic scene from Space Jam, and it relates directly to this, that the second thing could just be the confidence. Like say if you do wear this and the placebo effect is in place, hey, and it works, it works. Third thing, which is I think one of the biggest hidden variables about this, looking back on me, you know, wearing it, going out, meeting people and everything, is I found, like I said, I noticed better results. I talked to more people. I found that, you know, I had more success, so to speak. However, looking back on it, I did realize that when I was wearing this, I was more apt to want to talk to people to see, huh, does this actually have a better effect? So I found that I was almost wearing it and being more talkative or talking to more people in a roundabout way because I wanted to quote unquote test this out so much, I ended up meeting more people. And in a funny and almost ironic way, by me going out, meeting more people and really seeing if there's any effect, the more people that I met, statistically speaking, the more people that I met that were inevitably attracted to me, right? So it wasn't necessarily looking back and it maybe that people were super into me or whatever, just because of this, pure numbers, the more people that you talk to, the more people that you're gonna to talk to that are gonna be attracted to you. And I wonder if that's why maybe with this, looking back on it, that I really wanted to see, was there any effect? Maybe that was the case. However, I'd like to be very blunt, when I tested out that Pure Instinct uh, pheromone, you know, spray on, it was actually more of like a roll-on type product. 
I didn't really notice any benefit whatsoever, which leads me to the fourth point, and that is the smell. Now, I know I'm gonna be a bit vague here, but this smells like cologne. I'm not gonna lie, I'm the furthest thing from a cologne expert. So if you're curious, like, oh, like what type of cologne? I honestly don't know, I have to be very honest, it smells like cologne. I will say, I actually really do like the smell of it. Even ignoring the whole like pheromone aspect, I enjoy the smell. And so to me, I'm wondering in terms of the fourth point, maybe the only reason why I noticed any benefits at all is I just smelled good. And looking back when I used Pure Instinct, like I mentioned in that video, that smelled more like a perfume. It smelled, and I hate to use this word, but it's the best way I can describe it, that smelled very girly to me. Like it smelled like a perfume one of my girlfriends would wear when going out or whatever. So maybe the reason why the I noticed a way bigger benefit with this compared to Pure Instinct is that smelled more like a perfume. This smells more like a traditional cologne. So overall, is this worth it or not? Like I said, at the end of the day, whether it was the pheromones, the, the confidence, just these statistics of me talking to a lot of people or just the smell, I have to say, I did notice some benefit. Of course, it is tough to say. Was it a combination of all those points or a couple of them or a few of them or whatever? But again, at the end of the day, I will say I did notice better benefits, so to speak, wearing this than when I wasn't wearing it.